Welcome to the homework for lesson 27. This is module 2 of grade 1. Write your name first. Do it now. You won't remember to do it later. And it says solve the problems. Write the answers to show how many tens and ones. If there is only one ten, then cross off the S. So here we have 8 plus 5. Right, and if you can do this, you might be able to do this mentally. That's a 2 and a 3, right? There's your 10, so it's 10, 3. 10, 3, 13. That's 1, 10, so there's only 1, 10, so we'll cross out the S, and 3, 1s. To do this mentally, I'm going to think of this 4 as 2, 2s. Right, and if I take this 2 away from the 12, then I'll only have 10 left. And then I take this 2 away from the 10, then I'll have 8 left. And so that's, I only have 8 left. 8. So that's 0 10s and 8 1s. And if this, that little mental trick I just drew there doesn't make any sense to you. Just 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, cross out, 4, and count what's left. You'll have 6, 7, 8. Number 3, 15 minus 6. And we could do the same thing for this one. Uh, we could think of this 6 as a 5 and a 1. So 15 and 15 minus. So 15 minus the 5 would just leave us with the 10, and then one more would get us down to 9. Or you could just draw it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Cross out 6. You're going to have four left. So there's the four here and five here. Four plus five is nine. So there's nine ones left, but there's zero tens. And now there's 14 plus five. Well, you've got five more. So 14, right? 15, 16, 17, 18. 19, that's 19. That's 110 and 9 ones. But it's 110, not 110s. So we're going to cross out the S. And then uh, we've got 13 plus 5. So we're going to have this 10 still, and we're going to have this 3 plus 5. When we add our ones together. 3 plus 5 is 8, so we're going to have, still have that 10, and we're going to have 3 plus 5, that's, an, that's 8 ones, that's 18. And that's 1 10 and 8 ones. This trick doesn't always work. If these two numbers add up to 10 or more, then it's not going to be so easy. You can always just draw them. Draw the 13 and draw the 5 more. So this 17, and here's a uh, 17 minus 8. You could also do this as a number bond, right? You could do 10, 3, and then this is just a 5. And that's how you can add the, add the 10. When you add the 3 and the 5 together, you get 8, 10, 8, 18. Or you can just draw the whole thing and count it. 17 minus 8. So we have 17. That's 10. 7. This is a good. Minus 8s and minus 9s are good. Take from 10. So we take 8 from the 10. There'll be 2 left. 2 plus 7 is 9. 9 and 0 10s. 0 10s and 9 ones. Now we're going to do some 
RDW, read, draw and label, write a number sentence and a statement that matches the story. And we'll rewrite our answer to show its tens and ones. And that's what they're talking about down here with these. And if there's only one ten, we cross out the S. Mike has some red cars and eight blue cars. <clears throat> if Mike has nine red cars, how many cars does he have in all? So he has red cars and blue cars. So we have to find out how many he has. So there's eight blue cars. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. These are blue, B for blue. There's eight. And then we have the red cars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. These are the red cars. Nine. Eight plus nine. Now this nine, if I loop in that one there, that's a ten group. And that's seven, because it's one less than eight, so it's ten, seven, it's seventeen. And seventeen is one ten and seven ones, right? Because there's my ten, there's my ten group right here, and my seven ones. And uh, uh, let's see what else I have to do. Uh, oh, answer statement. Uh, Mike has seventeen cars. a lot of cars. It doesn't say they're toy cars either. Yanni and Han had 14 golf balls. They lost some balls. They had eight golf balls left. How many balls did they lose? So uh, they have 14 golf balls. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Um... They had eight golf balls left, so we'll cross out eight and see how many they lost. Uh, that's one, two, that's four, and two more, that's six. So let's label this. These are the uh, eight that they had left. And these are the ones they lost. So we started out with 14, we subtracted 8, and we had 6 left. They lost 6 balls. And that's 0, 10. Oops, 0, 10s, right? We can keep the S for 0. Zero tens and six ones. Nick rides his bike for six miles over the weekend. He rides 14 miles during the week. How many total miles does Nick ride? So six miles over the weekend, W, I'll use W for weekend. And that's one, two, three, four, five, six. And then we have 14 miles during the week. So I'll just call that D for during. The rest of the week. weekends are Saturdays and Sundays. And then the rest of the days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, those are weekdays. So weekend, those, that's Saturday and Sunday, and this is the, these are other days during the week. That's four, 14 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So let's see what we have here. We have 1, 2, 3, this is 6 here and then we need four more of these to make a group of ten and then here we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten that's another group of ten so we have two tens that makes twenty uh, but we're not gonna write ten plus ten equals twenty because we had six and fourteen were our group so this should be six plus fourteen equals twenty and twenty is two tens and zero ones. And we'll keep the S's for both of them this time. 